today was microscope day. Microscope day. Microscope day. Microscope day. Today I went on a tour of the Henrietta Lacks cells. I didn't know much about my great grandma Henrietta, but I know that she was an amazing person and her cells still live on today. Henrietta Lacks is my great great grandmother. My great grandmother went to John Hopkins Hospital because she had cervical cancer. They took the tissue out of her and it kept on growing and growing and growing. And her cells are still alive. Microscope Day gave us the opportunity to view my great grandmother Henrietta Lex cells. It was very important for us to view these cells. It was important because it gave us the opportunity to one, feel a little more closer as a family to our great grandmother because we didn't have a chance to meet her. As we were in there, we were viewing the cells. We were a little more closer and we learned a little more about our history and about how they divide and how they help people. So it brings us together as a family. My favorite part of the day was we went to see which room he actually took her cells from. And that was my favorite part because you can act like you're there and you can look out the window. He looked at my great grandmother's cells, Henrietta Lacks, the healer cells. They're found in polio vaccines, well basically all around us now. I thought it was pretty awesome. I think about both my grandma and my great grandma because my grandma was the one who told us about the cells, but I know where they basically came from. When I looked at those cells through the microscope, it was amazing because such tiny cells could cure millions of people, I mean the entire world. So that was important for our families to know that such a little part of our grandmother still divides and is conquering the world. <laughs>